Hola. Hola. I thought for a moment then that you were looking sad. No, uh, no After no. such a positive day, I was wondering yeah, why I you were looking thinking. sad. thinking. It has been a positive day, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been a positive day because obviously after coming from Spa, where the last downforce track, where, where we struggled a lot, we expected to not be very competitive here. But uh, I must say that since FP1, the car has felt in a much better window, in a much better position than where it was in Spa. Lap times were coming easy, the stopwatch doesn't lie, and we were yeah, more and more on the pace. So uh, it's been a pleasant surprise. It doesn't mean we are the fastest. I don't think we are the fastest out there by any means, especially in the long runs, but at least we are closer than what, uh, than what we thought. car looks more trimmed out than we've seen it all season. How is it to drive? It is, uh, <laughs> it is actually better than expected. I thought after Spa, because in Spa we did a session with lower rear wing and it didn't feel great. Here coming down on, on wing, we've been trimming down for the whole day and it just kept feeling better and better. So it's one of those things F1 that F1 has, that is sometimes in one circuit, some things work in others doesn't. It's very difficult to understand, understand the sport sometimes, but uh, it brings you some bad surprises and some good ones. We know we haven't seen everything from Red Bull yet, but do you think, not just on one lap, but race pace, that uh, you may be able to contend with them this weekend? I think so. I think uh, over one lap, I think we, we will contend, or I think we might contend, but uh, over the long run, they look as strong as always, like they've been recently, especially Max on that medium today looked particularly quick. Well, for me, the medium, it felt more like a bit of a struggle, but, um, you know, if we do the right steps going into tomorrow, maybe we can close the gap. A lot of grid penalties, though, will shake up the order. Yes, let's see, let's see. Let's see how the grid penalties shake up the order. Uh, I think there's going to be people taking five places, 10 places, 15 places, others taking back of the grid, which means it doesn't matter if the guy in front takes 10, that you are back of the grid. So let's see how the grid uh, sets it's set up and from there we, we will see what we can do.